are headed back to Disney Springs today after a nice sleep. We had to sleep in a little bit today because whew, Universal kicked my butt. I calculated and we walked eight miles. And then I calculated that we got about $130 worth of food and drink for free included with the dining plan. So I would say yesterday was a win. A big win. And uh, so now we're on our way back to Disney Springs and we'll probably hit the outlets later for a little bit. Yeah. Um, so let's see, let's see what we find today. Oh, there's the Christmas music. We're back at Disney Springs. Get some goodies. And again, we're gonna have to go to that temperature checkpoint right here to get in. Let's see. Oh, heading right back into the co-op. Thank you. Love all the Christmas music and everything. All right, this store is not too bad. It is a little crowded today because it's a Sunday, so we're just gonna keep our distance. If it gets a little too overwhelming, we'll end up leaving. But uh, as of right now, it's not too bad in here, so. So I got something, I got something for Mosley, and now we have to get Jen one something. I think she's gonna go with this, cause she's a little hot wearing that today. I don't know why she wore it when it was uh, 72 degrees out today. What were you saying? I was saying, I can't pay $35 for a tank top. I don't yeah. know, like, I do draw the line some places, even though I do like to overspend sometimes. Right, no, I get it. So we're gonna try to find something a little better, you know? We'll see, we'll see what we can find. I had to stop and get a smoothie, something a little healthier from all the food we ate yesterday. We got to get some smoothies. Alright, so we went with the flying Hawaiian and the yep. mango tango. And I'm surprised this line, there, was, there wasn't any. Everybody's yeah. waiting in line for pretzels. Like, yeah. what? Like, smoothies dude, are better. It's, it's hot out today. It's get a smoothie. Exactly. Who wants a hot pretzel right I now? don't. <laughs> I said we had to go with something a little healthier right now. Yeah. Since all the food we ate yesterday. Yep, and we have to get ready for tomorrow where we're going to be eating here. Yeah, at Epcot, so yeah. Also, Sunday is not the day to come. No, this is horrible. It's worse than Friday. Yep. Um, Friday was actually not bad at all. No, um, I'm kind of disappointed. It's pretty good, yeah. Because... And I figured Sunday was going to actually be pretty bad, but yeah. she also thought it was when a bunch of people were going to be uh, going back home from vacation. Um, so if you're uncomfortable with the coronavirus stuff, uh, you know, then don't come on a Sunday. We definitely always try to do our stuff during the weekdays. So uh, we don't know how long we're going to stay here just because it is a little uncomfortable, but we are taking every precaution possible right now. Yeah, a couple people did, did like cut us off and like bump into us. So yeah, we'll see how long we end up staying. All right, time to taste these smoothies. Pat, what do you think of the Sometimes tropical Hawaiian? Hawaiian? It's a fine Hawaiian. Fine it's Hawaiian. Hawaiian? It's really good. Mango Tango is really good. So if you I want something taste. healthy here at Disney yeah. Springs, because I know the food's super good, but sometimes it's not always healthy, go for Joffrey smoothies. Yep. No way. And it's good awesome. because it's nice and hot out, so it's good. It's like yep. refreshing. Exactly. And uh, mine's like nice and sweet. You can taste the mango. You can taste mine the peach. Too. I taste the pineapple. Yeah, the fresh fruit. that's really, really good. <laughs> See, look, you just got to find yourself some spots around. There's barely anybody around over here. Thank goodness. Just gotta go and you know go where you're comfortable. Yeah, exactly. So, that's basically it, you know. So Disney Springs always has these like funny decorations. Like they have like steampunk deer, and then they have like these metal sculpture penguins. That is too cute. Yeah. And look at this, another great photo spot right here with this beautiful fountain right next to the steakhouse. And there's too much room to hang out here. Yeah, Nobody's it's, it's around. wide open. Look, look, look. I'll just keep backing up. Wide open. Nobody here. Nobody here. Christmas decorations. Everything. A very pretty photo walk. That's right. <laughs> we are also right next to Planet Hollywood, where last time we were here, we got the amazing food. And we got that amazing milkshake. And we got the tenders with the cereal crust. Um, yeah, the cereal breading, I should say. Uh, I think we got the mac and cheese, like grilled cheese. So good. If you want to see all those things, like check out our vlogs, uh, our last vlogs from our Disney Springs and everything. It'll all be in there. So basically this side of Disney Springs, which I forget which, which side this one is called, 
it is not the main side the main side with the world of disney store and everything that's the side that's really really packed right now because it has all the disney stores and everything i'm sure everybody's trying to get disney merchandise all that kind of stuff there's lines to get and everything this side where planet hollywood is is the side that is not very busy at all it kind of seems like it was friday pretty wide open not too crowded so if you want to come here on a sunday you know spend most of your time over on this side <laughs> you don't even know the words i don't sorry can't even take her anywhere Hey, we're in a great spot to show off the outfit of the day. Look at the mask, the Christmas mask. Her favorite Disneyland hoodie, the highlighter, like neon green. Biker shorts, some Nikes, fresh. It's not a park outfit. But, no, it's a Disney Springs but it's outfit. But it's a Disney Springs outfit. Right. And don't let anybody fool you. Matt is cute, okay? Look at that mask. He got his Mickey Mouse shirt on. He's got some nice shorts. He's got the high socks and some rose sheets. Oh crap, and he also got his Mickey Mouse hat. And turn around, babe, we got the back. Oh, we got the back of the shirt. The, and it's literally the back of Mickey Mouse. And then we also got the backpack. Show him the backpack, babe. Look, Fantasia, the original Mickey Mouse, and then this one walking. So cute. I know this video looks familiar, but we're back in the Coca-Cola store. I need a top. I know, Jen needs a uh, top because it's so hot outside. Because we're in the city. That's pretty cute, right? That is cute. Yeah. See what she ends up with. Right? But I mean, there's so much to choose from. There's a wall of Coca Cola merchandise. And if you didn't know, this place is three stories. So the first floor is all Coca Cola apparel, hats, shirts, pants, whatever you whatever you want. The floor above is merchandise like coffee cups, signs, whatever you you know. Oh, there we go. And then the top floor is the Coca Cola bar where you can get you know, Coca-Cola products, ices. You can get alcoholic beverages, like specialty alcoholic yep. beverages. You can get Coca-Cola flights. It's really cool. You can get everything. Yeah. So is this the, is this the winner? I think I might because it matches the mask really well. Yes, it does. And it's, it's on sale. $5. On sale for five bucks? All right. Well, Jen found her. It actually shirt. was not the shirt I showed you. I know. It was a different one. Right after I showed that shirt off, I found another one I liked even better. On sale too? Yep, I put it right on, I put the tag off and gave it to the guy, yep, the register. And you were good to go. Yep, and I also got a pair of biker shorts that were super Ooh. cute and also on sale for $7. Coca-Cola biker shorts. Right. Also, it smells delicious out here and it's making me hungry, but we're trying to like fast because we ate so much yesterday and we're gonna be eating so much tomorrow. So we're trying to take it easy today. It's so hard because there's yeah. so much good food here. I know. All right, well, look at this Baby Yoda jacket, by the way. Oh, this, Columbia, that is this is a Mandalorian collection by Columbia. That's so adorable. Look at these. And they have it displayed right here. Right so here. So the Mandalorian collection. Back for Christmas, you know. Yep. This is the way. All right, we're going it's to Sugar because Sugar Jen Boo. really likes this store. Yeah, I do. Let's see what we got Molly's all yours. Yes. Love. It's really cool in here. They got a lot of craftsy stuff. Yeah, just a lot of farmhouse kind a lot of, of decor. Yeah, a lot of farmhouse. I've been to. Like you can see the art on the walls. Yeah, all this kind of stuff. Mugs. All right, look at these. They have towels for towels the kitchen. For kitchens. And it's we found so we found the Maryland one, and, and it's, it's really so cool. Cute. Let Jen show you real quick. Yeah. Just a little bit of it. We're not gonna this is the it. front. Look at that. Really so cool. cute. Francis got key. They got the Oreo. Oreo and then on the back, they've got Edgar Allan Poe. They got the blue crab and the sailboat. Yeah. They even got Scotland. I was down there the other day. It's Ocean not city and then... very popular. So when Apples is on there, that's where I'm from. Yeah. We lived in Davidsonville. Perfect. That's awesome. Yeah, it's super really cute. Cool. It's only $20. What? Really? I would, I would assume that it would be more expensive just because it's so yeah. hard to see. Yeah, right. And plus, I feel like stuff in here is very crafty yes. and artsy, so it's like handmade and it's stuff so usually. Lovely. So I feel like it'd be way more expensive. It's also like really, really pretty in here. They got the fountain, and I want to show off this tree. It's the 
Mickey and Minnie tree from the Christmas tree trail in Disney Springs that you can do. It's really cool. You can see the bow, oh, the bow at the top. You can see the Mickey Mouses, the bows, the ornaments that are their colors. And if you go a little further, you got the Pluto tree. Yeah, it's got bones, it's got dog bowls in there. At the very top, you got his doghouse. And it says Pluto on name tag right there. Also, we were talking about Disney Springs, like one of a kind Christmas decorations, I feel like. It's all blinged out. Look at this blinged out deer, reindeer. I love American Threads. I've never been in here, but this dress is only $60. I know that sounds like a lot to some people, but uh, I'm a big fan of free people and that's like on sale. So all these are full price. It's only 60 bucks. It's just freaking gorgeous. And I've got another dress over there that's also 60. Um, but it's just so sexy. I'll show you. Only $60. I feel like that's a good price point for these quality clothes. What do you think? Yep. You know my free people addiction. I know. It's dangerous. This is much better. American Threads. Okay, well maybe I'm a, I'm a new fan of this place. All right, next tree that we found is the Fantasia tree, which is really, really pretty. Lanterns, got the buckets, musical notes, and all the way at the top, you got Mickey's hat. Here are those like steampunk gear reindeer that I was They're talking so about cool. earlier. Yeah. All right, so right here we find we have the Mulan tree. Very beautiful. Wow, beautiful. Yes, it is. And it's got the dragon, all the red balls, and if you look in right here, there's Lucy right there. Look at that. So Very pretty, the flowers all on it. Baby, I want my picture in front of this. All right, we found the Star Wars tree here. You can see it's got the Jawas in there. It's got TIE Fighter ornaments, Stormtroopers. It's got a BB-8 body at the top. You got Chewbacca's little uh, thing that he wears. And at the very top, you got a lightsaber. So we're at the food truck. It's a party over here. Yep, yep. Got a DJ. And we're coming because Santa's coming. Oh my god, it's reindeer over there, babe. Yep, I see it. We'll see it. And the hot air balloon's going up. Right as Santa's coming by. <laughs> That's Here they come. Jen decided to go with this truck right here, and we got the lobster and shrimp mac and cheese, which is that right there. It's like gonna be so good. Doing a beef prepared. mac and cheese and we got the street tacos from right here four rivers cantina 
Hey, you said you to eat healthy today. We got, well, I'm, wanted, I'm hungry and we haven't eaten yet today. And it's like three o'clock, so. True. But we got three different ones. I know we have the tri-tip steak. Mm -hmm. We got the... The chicken tinga. The chicken tinga, yep. And the brisket barbacoa, mm -hmm. I think it's called. They look really, really good. We're gonna dig in and try all this. So I just tried the lobster and shrimp mac and cheese. It is amazing. Ooh. I can make a whole meal out of this. <laughs> and the thing is, it's big enough to where you definitely could share. Mm -hmm. Definitely a shareable portion. Um, yeah, really, really good. I would definitely like to get this again, for sure. Right. Okay, I've never had lobster mac and cheese, so I'm trying it now. Mm. It's good stuff. Mm -hmm. Now, what did you think of the taco? You had the taco, right? The taco was really good, the inside filling. Mm -hmm. But honestly, the tortillas are a little tough. A little tough? Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. But really good mac and cheese. Is it worth it? No. Oh yeah, no, definitely. Okay. What do you like better so far? I like the filling of the taco. Filling in the taco? Yeah. All right, I'll have to try the taco. Mm -hmm. Chicken one was very good. This was the brisket one that you just ate. What do you think of that one? It's definitely brisket. Um, I like the chicken one better. The chicken one's a better one for you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Then we have to try the steak one. Yeah. All right. Okay. Steak. I don't like that you're filming me because it's going to be gross. Tri-tip steak. Get in on that. Oh. And. Just keep that chewing up. Come on. You are a long chewer. I need a verdict. The people need to know what's going down. What 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 the verdict is on the tri tip. Okay. To be polite. It's really good taste wise. I think you like steak better. Mm -hmm. I just think it's a little tough to chew. Okay. So can you rate them one, two, and three between the brisket, chicken, and the steak? Chicken number one. Steak number two. Brisket number three. Okay. There you go. All right. For me, it was steak one. I'm gonna go ahead and say the brisket was two okay. and the chicken was three for me. Okay. Yeah, so completely different. Fight about it? We were completely, yeah, <laughs> let's go. So, no, it was really good. And the lobster mac and cheese is just phenomenal. So, yeah, really lobster and shrimp mac and cheese. So, I'm gonna continue eating that. So, say what you just said about the mac and cheese. I don't remember what I said about the mac and cheese. Could you have finished it by yourself? Oh yeah, no, I would not have been able to finish it by myself. I was just asking him, like, do you think you'd be able to smash this whole thing, the rest of it? You're like, no, you gotta split it. I feel like, unless you're really just one of those people that can go ham on a big thing of mac and cheese by yourself, yeah. don't try to do it alone. The mac and cheese was $13, so I think for like a shareable, that's a good item. price. No, it really is. Great price, and then the tacos were $13 yes. as well. So I feel like we just got a really good lunch. Very no, filling, really, good exactly lunch full. that was perfect for two people. Why'd you do that to me, babe? We're supposed to be healthy today. I know. Now we can't eat until dinner. <laughs> and then at dinner, we'll just get salads. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see how, we'll see if that actually happens. So I also want to say that I feel as if that food was that that portion i'm comfortable full like i'm not like i'm comfortable i'm not like stuffed full so like i feel good you know what do you all right we had to stop and get a drink after the that meal so we decided to go with the limited edition sprite winter spiced cranberry so let's see how it tastes Kind of like the cinnamon thing, like you get the Sprite and then the aftertaste is definitely cranberry. Let's see what Jack thinks about that. You like it? Do you think it's better than the cinnamon coke? They're two different things, I feel like. Yeah, I agree. Like that, they're both so refreshing in their own ways. And they, they definitely have a very holiday-esque vibe oh, yeah. and no, taste. Totally. So I really like them. So you're good either way, guys, yeah. in the cinnamon coat or the Try them both. Try them both. Really try them both. Right I'm not there. a big soda drinker, but I really like both of them. Yeah, we had to try them while we were here. Exactly. So. We're drinking at the station. I love, this is like one of my favorite areas right here. I just think it's so nice. Isn't it? I love it. 
a little glass orb. I know. All they all light up light at the end up, of the yeah. night. They're all different Christmas stores. Yeah. I love it. I think it's so beautiful over here. So here's a dog shop right here, and look, they got the one dog cocking its leg. <laughs> Little head dogs. They have all kinds of dog ornaments, stockings. And holiday treats. Holiday treats. Look at that. Little magnets, toys, collars. Moses is going to end up getting one of these collars, I'm telling you, because I really like this Baby Yoda one right here. And I like this Mickey one. So many to choose from. So I have a little bit of a serious topic to talk about, and yes. that is safety precautions at Disney during coronavirus. We saw something a little troubling today, which just was a really great reminder to us yep. that we need to be a little safer. Mm -hmm. We were at the Coke store, like having a really good time getting a few goodies, and we saw a little boy in front of us with his mask half down. He was wiping his nose, and he was touching every single mask yep. at the cashier. He walked away. He did it again, pulled down his mask, rubbed his nose, and Started touched all the masks. Literally picking up picking every up single mask. Every single one of them. There was a display, and there were a bunch of masks, and he was touching all of them. Yeah. Every single one. So I'm thinking, how many other things has he touched since he's been there in yeah. other stores, wiping his nose mm -hmm. and wiping, you know, all that stuff? And, and, and apparently, kids carry it. And so, you don't even yeah. know, and they pass it along to adults. A so. Princeton study was released recently that said children are the super spreaders. You know, you don't know what they're touching, what kind of germs they're picking up, and then they bring it home and they give it to people who are more at risk, yep. the adults, and then they are fine. Right, and we didn't even think about it. Like, we've been doing great with, like, distancing mm -hmm. from people, wearing our masks. Yeah. Um, and it's kind of something we, we forgot about is, like, you have to look with your eyes mm -hmm. and not your hands. And yeah. we were kind of... We've been touching yeah, things. Yeah, touching some stuff. So we were like, okay, we just need to be reminded, you know, to <laughs> not basically do the right thing. So... Yeah. And, you know, I tried to do the right thing. So I actually called the Coke store afterwards. I was just so in shock yeah. that I didn't say anything when I was there. But I called the Coke store, you know, and I said, hey, this is what I saw. Like... You might want to sanitize, you know, the counters, the masks, like, you you know, just to be on the safe side. And they're very appreciative. Yeah, they were. They said thank you. Because, um, look, they wouldn't have known. And what mm -hmm. if what if that kid was carrying something and other people came in there and were buying masks, masks? and touching them? Oh, and they're and putting then on their all faces. those people could have got sick. Yeah. So Jen just felt like she needed to do her part mm -hmm. and at least just give them a call and say, hey, I just want to let you know. You know, we came in there a little bit ago and we, you know, we exactly. bought some stuff and had a great time. Mm -hmm. um, but I just want to let you know that there was a little boy who was rubbing his nose and touching every, you know, yeah. all these masks and everything. So they said, thank you so much. Yep. We're going to sanitize that stuff. We really appreciate it. Yep. So exactly. So hopefully they, you know, they're doing their part too. I know it means a lot that they keep their business open. So I'm sure that they're doing something, you know, to sanitize. That's right. So remember, uh, wash your hands and use hand sanitizer and, and don't touch anything yeah <laughs> we're back at it heading back to disney springs to get some dinner to finish some some, some shopping yep that's right we are currently headed back right now we need some dinner like i said it's a it's a nice walk it takes us about 25 minutes i would say to walk from the resort there keeps us healthy yeah and like we need to, all this food we're eating we need to walk <laughs> right we probably walked almost 16 miles since we've been here yeah. Been here like two and a half days. Two and a half days, and we've literally probably walked 16 miles. Um, but it's good. Like I said, you, you gotta do this when you're if, when you have the opportunity when you're eating a bunch of crap. Yeah. <laughs> so we're probably gonna hit a couple stores. Um, Sunday evenings typically aren't as busy because it's Sunday during the day that's busy. <laughs> um, yeah. So grab some dinner, go to a couple shops. And call it a night before we have to go to Epcot tomorrow oh for Festival of the Holidays. So we also did want to come at night so that we could see the lights. Look at this. This is just the start of it. See, this is so romantic. I know. I love it. Mm. Look at this tree. Look at the look at the star. And it's gotta say, it's a lot more peaceful tonight. Yes, it is. Very peaceful oh, feel. Ready. Nice music. Just people walking slow. Like you know. Oh my god, it smells so good. Is that popcorn? It smells absolutely delicious. Oh right? my god. Look at 
constantly have DJs all day. It's a party. It really is a party. And didn't you say these fish tanks are done by uh, uh, um, tank. 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 That's yeah. too cool. They made this fish tank with the big octopus over top of us. So it seems like every time we come here, we end up getting the bar seating now because it's just like. You don't have to wait. Yeah, you don't have to wait. You we just don't like wait. Anymore. I don't mind it. Like, the bar is really cool. It's you, get the fish, you get the fish tank right here. You get all. You still have everything around us. Like, yeah, man, it's behind us and stuff. Yeah, we got dinosaurs right here. Like, yeah, we don't care. We're just gonna eat some good food. So the menu is pretty good. It's a little on the pricey side, but they got some good stuff on here. I think I'm gonna go for a burger tonight. And I gotta say, this fire uh, roasted rotisserie chicken is amazing. I always, I always love these baby mammoths. I think they're so cute. Shower, you're glowing. Am I in a phosphorus? Yeah. yeah. You saw those? Yeah, I did. Oh my god. Oh, is this one of the ends? Oh boy. So, like Rainforest Cafe does the thunderstorm, this place does the meteor shower. This is Jen's favorite fountain right here. She loves to get her picture look taken in front of it. That and, know, it's and look adorable. at the, the Twinkie Lily lights. The Twinkie lights, and then they have poinsettias in different pots. So they're definitely trying to different for the holidays. That's right. Well, we're currently in line waiting for the World of Disney store where they have the markers out front. Like good little boys and girls. Yeah, they have the markers all the way around the back. And then right here to get in. So we're just waiting, we got a couple things we want to get tonight before our Epcot trip tomorrow. So I'm really liking these sweaters, man. I really like them. I like this one, this one. I like this one for Jen. Well, it is 45 each when you buy two. Oh, so if you buy two of them, it's kind of a good deal. $45. Let's put a deal on what they're yeah. at now. I know. They have a couple over here that are nice too. Yeah, don't you just love the music with all the light and everything? It's very festive at night. Yes. Alright, we're gonna go with Star Wars. Gonna be a little bit of weight, I know. It's a good thing we got a Star Wars galaxy today. I really like this one actually. Cute. Good job, Liz. I'm wrapping that. And me and Jen actually just got this one earlier. This is... This is... Look at this loud slide. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. You know what? I really like this coffee cup. That coffee cup's amazing. Yep, yeah. coming in. Marvel section. Oh, look at the baby Groots. That's pretty cool. You get the, it's like a speaker, like a Bluetooth speaker. That's too cool, man. And you can get a Groot to go with it. They got all kinds of stuff in there. All Marvel. You can even get a Guardians of the Galaxy Lounge fly over there. Just for you, babe. I know, shirts, whatever, whatever you want. 
all things Groot over here. This ornament, too adorable. I need the coffee mug. I'm gonna get one of these hats. It's on your shoulder. I have these adorable hats. Okay. Wow. They sell stitch. Candy. candy. They're all like sour candies. Yeah, but you like that. Candy. I do, I really do. No, it looks really good. That's cool. I know, right? And they got the popcorn. This is right up Jen's alley. They got the jelly beans. Yes. Are you eat a lot of those? Yes. Jen loves the jelly beans. Goofies and goofies candies. Isn't that adorable? They got Mickey's like chocolates. Mm -hmm. Goofies and Incredibles. Yeah. 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 I love the ceiling. You can on the ceiling too. Wow. And they have the... Wow. Yeah. This is good stuff right here. Yeah, these are all the holiday candy. Yeah. Look at the cookies. cookies. Look at that giant cookie. Yeah. Giant yeah. cookie right and there. And the rice cookie cake for this one. Yeah, I know. Look at those. Look at good. Cupcakes. The holiday cookies. Right now. I know. Man. Yeah, they all look so good. They also have many, many candies. Cook, uh, cookies. Yeah. Cotton candy with Dumbo. So they have the fresh ones right here. And then over here, they're making the treats. Not to mention, they have like a power, power slushy. I've never heard of that ever. I have never heard of a power flavor. It looks like a lemonade, a lime, and an orange. Wow. I love the candy yeah, cauldron. I love. Where they make all the candy right here. Candy and sweet. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. Oh, they're making gingerbread houses. Yeah. That looks so good. All this looks so good. Wow. Looks like they're about to do something real, real good over here. Some of the holiday apples right now. My favorite one is probably the Santa. Yeah, I do like that one too. That one's cute. And then here's the plain apples right here. I don't think that's they're poison apples. Oh, that's right. Just like that. Poison apples. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're changing color. I know, the lights change color. That's so fun. We got all the holiday decorations. Everything is lit up. Not too busy. Love it. Love Christmas time at Disney anything. Also looks like they renamed the hangar bar and it smells delicious. Out here, it really it. does. But they got their decorations up for the holidays. Yep. The holidays hangar bar. Yep. And you know, we've got pentatonics on repeat yep. playing the best <laughs> classics. Fun fact, Matt's dad. Uh, he's like obsessed he's with pentatonics. He's obsessed with pentatonics. Uh, so, don't know what that means, yeah. but he is. <laughs> Boathouse has their Christmas decorations up and their snowmen that me and Jen have a holiday picture uh, yes, with. That you could, photo. you could see them right over here. We'll get a little closer. These They're snowmen so right there. There they are. We got a picture with those. We did a boat boot. That's right. So we're gonna now, get a hot coffee. It's drizzling now, it's a little cold, so we're gonna get some job for you. Oh, look at this, they have a lion's latte. That. That's new. Sweet white chocolate and cool peppermint coffee. Are you kidding me? Ooh. Yeah, this is like Disney, Disney's like coffee brand, basically. I, wanna, I think I might want to try that Lion's Latte. Really? Oh, uh, they probably can't. They copied like it self, last time, you know? right? Yeah, they might be able to do it for you. Yeah. That's what it looks like they have going on over there. Look, it looks like they have the Homer Simpson. But that's, that's this right here. Thank you. You can even get Joffrey's pins. And you can get big old donuts. That, that look, amazing. They're a little bit smaller than the Simpsons. Yeah. There's the Yeah. You can get all this goodness right here. I got some good looking coffee right here. Yeah, 
Looks like some good stuff. Okay, so we obviously, oh my god. Um, so we obviously just got a coffee. Some caffeinated latte. Yep. But I also saw that they had frozen drinks and they had a frozen vanilla chai. Um, what? And so I was talking about it and the employee said, hey, I can get you some. So I'm trying it now. delicious. Good. We'll be coming back and getting this on a warmer day. That's right. She already let me try a little bit. It was really, really good. So, good stuff. Love Joffrey's, man. Yeah. It's like it's like Disney's coffee brand, basically. Yeah. It's so good. They give excellent service, just like everything that yeah. Disney does. Exactly. So. T-Rex, baby. That's, That's why they call it T-Rex. That's right. Show the front side. It's like a big rock. It's really cool. I mean, that must have been I remember as a kid coming and I remember seeing when it was under construction and not knowing what it was. Yeah. And now we go all the time. I know. This mocha latte is like hitting the spot and it's just <laughs> so good. Every time I've had Joffrey's, I'm like, oh. Like, I, I mean. I wish we had a Joffrey's back home, honestly. No, for real. Like, <laughs> Joffrey's coffee is like really, really good. Like, yes, it's honestly better than Starbucks. I was just about to say the same thing. I was, I was about to say I'm gonna go ahead and say something controversial here, <laughs> but I think it's better than Starbucks. <laughs> I really do. Look at all the twinkly lights in the trees. I love it. And then, and then the Ferris wheel is all Ferris lit up. Wheel. You know, you could get a picture by the Ferris wheel with the twinkly trees. Oh, I can. So it is Christmas time in Disney. But uh, at Disney Springs, they have a Christmas store all year round. So you can come to this store whenever, in June if you want to. My sister would love this section. <laughs> and they have all Christmas. Christmas spirit jerseys, ears, light ups, shirts, leggings. This shirt. You like that? That's like a nice like nighttime shirt, yeah, honestly. It really is. Socks. There's some Christmas socks. Two of my favorite things, Disney and Christmas in one. Look at the slippers. Oh see that's for you. Hey, that's for you. Gingerbread stuff, and then you walk into the store of all the ornaments. All the ornaments all you the, could want in your life. All the princess ornaments all here. The they also have deals. You're getting $15 off. Yeah, $15 off if you buy three. That's a good deal. Usually, I mean, when people come here, they're buying a lot of ornaments. Well, that's so, what I'm saying. You, know? you can buy a whole tree of Right. Ornaments. I think you would love these ornaments. I've never seen these. They have here. They have the same ones that like you have. Like you can get the ornaments of whatever ears you, you get. Like you can now have these. You have these. You probably will end up with these. That's really cool. I've never seen those before. And they have all the other characters. They have like pics. They have Toy Story. Toy Story is coming out of Toy Story. Oh, they got Ratatouille down here. And they got more like Mickey and Minnie. Oh, I love this one. I think you know that, that I love this one. Because this is the one with all the theme parks inside. Yeah. I always tell you that. Come down here is a holiday one. Yeah, and then they have a little more, like they have. And they have packs. That's what I like. You get packaged ones. And then they have like cars. They have cars. They're forty-five for the packs. Yeah, so these right here are forty-five, but you're getting four. That's a pretty good deal. Yeah. And there's more. You get Olaf, Forky, cars. They got the sloth. Oh my from uh, Zootopia. I love Zootopia. We should watch it. I know. It's such a good movie. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> Toy Story 4. See, they got every ornament oh, you could think of. Those are ours. 
This is one. This is one's baby. This yeah. one's at dinner. We have, the same, we have the same love as Minnie and Mickey. We really do. Some of my favorites are Tangled. I like Moana. And then look at this Lilo and Stitch one. That is a cute one, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, they have Mary Poppins. Oh, and I love Mary Poppins. That's right. Perfect. And for those of you who are ready for 2021, because 2020 has been eventful, <laughs> they have 2021 Nikki plushies. That's pretty cute. Oh, that's cute. Also, 2021 Yeah, you know, as long as the world doesn't explode. Who knows what can happen? At the pin store, currently. Oh, I would like this one before the people. Seeing all the good stuff oh, they have. Okay. Some sports ones. Some Star Wars pins. There's one specific pin I'm looking for at the moment that I've seen on some other people's vlogs, but I have not been able to find it. These ones are really cool. These theme park ones. We got some Marvel pins. And this whole place, I'm not gonna be able to show you every pin in here because the, it's literally a whole circle. The place goes all the way around. Pins everywhere. And there's just pins everywhere, on every wall, so. So these are like the pins. They're slides. Wally, and I think her name is. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, they have a Mickey and Minnie one too. Look. Mickey and Minnie slides. Dude, those are cool. I've never seen those before. They have Converse's too. Look. Some. And they got the laces on. Them. Yeah. Those are so cool. Yeah, they really are. They got a lot of cool ones. Wow. Imagine designing the pins for a living. I know. How fun cool, would right? that be?